Hi, my name is Chi. Welcome to my YouTube channel. You're watching Petite Dressing. This is another video about how to dress for your body shape and our topic today is party outfits. If you're wondering what is the best party outfit for your particular body type, you should have a pretty good idea after you watch this video. In today's video, I will cover the five common body types, pear, hourglass, apple, rectangle, and inverted triangle. If you don't already know what body type you are, I have another video that talks about how to find out your body type in four easy steps. I will leave the link to that video down below. If you already know what body type you are, let's get started. The hourglass shape. You are very lucky to be blessed with very feminine curves. To you, dressing up in party outfits is probably easier than dressing down in jeans and t shirt So, dressing up for this party and play up with the curves. If you are planning on wearing dresses, then make sure the dress is structured and that can hold it all in. What exactly do I mean by that? What that means is the fabrics of the dress should have enough weight to support your curves. In terms of the neckline, the ideal neckline for the hourglass shaped ladies are the deep V neck or the U neck, or you can call it the square neckline. Both of these necklines will show off your full chest and draw attention up front. If you want to take away some focus from your cleavage, then consider wearing a dress with puff sleeves because that will draw attention to your shoulders and upwards to your face. And that will make sure your cleavage is not the only thing that people are focusing on. When I see wearing a structured dress, that doesn't necessarily mean you have to wear something skin tight. A safe bet for the hourglass shape is a wrap dress. A wrap dress emphasizes your curve in a very tasteful and elegant way. Because of the wrap, it highlights your tiny waistline, so shows off your full bust and your round hip. The hourglass shape ladies, if you are considering wearing skirts, then a classic high-waisted pencil skirt is a wonderful choice for you because it highlights the curves of your bottom perfectly and tastefully. Number two, the pear shapes ladies. If you are a pear shape, your shoulders tend to be narrower than your hips and your thighs. So for you, the focus of your party outfit should be broadening your shoulders to balance out your broader hips and thighs. If you're thinking about dresses, consider fit and flare dress. This is a generally flattering dress shape and it works on more than one body type and it's especially flattering to the pear-shaped ladies. Because the, fair, the fit and flare dresses is the A shape, it flares out right under your waistline, so it bypasses your thighs and your butt. That will draw attention away from your prominent thighs. In terms of your neckline, consider something that expands your shoulders. A strapless dress is a perfect choice for you, and so is the off-the-shoulder dresses. A shrug goes perfectly with a strapless dresses as it makes your shoulder look broader and also help you adjust to the temperature difference. If you are considering wearing separates, you can wear dress pants and make sure they are not the skinny jeans because the skinny cut highlights the curves of your, on your butt and your thighs. If you don't want that to be the focal point of your outfit, then go with white leg pants. A white leg pants that has enough weight that drape down from your hips straight to the floor and make sure it's long enough and pair them with dress heels. 
Number three, the apple body shape. If you're an apple body shape, you tend to have midsection concern, even though you could be skinny elsewhere. I am a skinny apple, so I always know the challenge to dress an apple body shape. For us apple body shape ladies, our assets is in the upper body. You want to draw attention to your face and to your full bust. A lot of apple shape ladies also have skinny arms and legs. Those are also our assets and you should definitely play them up. So make sure you choose a dress that is not too long and for petite ladies, you probably want to go with above the knee or right at the knee so that you can show off your nice shapely legs. If you want to draw attention above to your chest, you can wear some nice statement jewelry to draw attention to the front. Another important thing for apple body shape ladies is that you should invest in a very supportive bra. We have very nice chest and when you wear supportive underwear, the shape of your chest look very nice and that will also help draw attention away from our midsection. Now, the key to hide the midsection of the apple body shape is that you can choose some smart designs of the dresses or the tops that will smooth out your midribs. For example, dresses or tops with ruching design I have found are extremely flattering for women with midsection concerns. I have mentioned fade and flare dress before. That is also a good choice for the apple shaped ladies. Make sure the waistline of the dress is higher than your natural waistline. That way it will make your stomach less noticeable. The apple shaped ladies can also consider deep V neck or the scoop neck because those necklines will draw attention to the front and show off your chest, which is one of your best assets as well. Another wonderful choice for the apple shaped ladies is a peplum top or a peplum dress. A peplum flares out above your waistline and it covers your midsection in a smart way. Number four is a rectangle body shape. This is known as the easiest to dress body shape because your body shape looks straight up and down and that is the shape of a lot of supermodels. So a lot of the dresses are actually made according to this body shape. You will find a lot of dresses will look just fine on you. If you are interested in adding some curves to your body shape, then consider some feminine design. In terms of the color of the dress, you can consider something more dramatic. Instead of wearing the same solid color from head to toe, you probably want to consider color blocking or dramatic prints. If you are petite, make sure you don't choose a print that's too overwhelming because you do have a smaller petite frame and you don't want to feel overwhelmed whelmed by the prints. Any dress or skirts that add more shapes to your body will look great on the rectangle body shape. For instance, consider the A-line shape skirt or the fit and flare silhouette for the dress. Another dress silhouette that works wonderfully on the rectangle shape ladies is the mermaid shape. You can wear a dress with a flounce skirt or a skirt with flounces. Number five, the inverted triangle. Similar to the rectangle shape ladies, this is another shape that a lot of supermodels have. Naomi Campbell, Cameron Diaz. So those are the ladies that dress very well. And you can imagine a lot of dresses or party outfits will look just fine on you. The inverted triangle ladies, the first thing people notice about your body is probably your broad shoulders and that's how we have this name as an inverted triangle. So for you, your focus should be the opposite of the pear-shaped ladies. 
Even though you will find a lot of dresses work just fine on you, if you want, you can work on bringing more volume to your bottom half to balance out your broad shoulders. A peplum dress is a perfect example because the peplum flares out just on your hips and it adds volume to your hip but because the inverted triangle ladies tend to have smaller waist and smaller hips so you can afford that. Another good choice you can consider is a tulle skirt. A tulle skirt has a lot of pleats and it also adds volume to your hips. That would be a perfect way to balance out your broad shoulders. Like the rectangle shaped ladies, the inverted tri triangle shaped ladies can also consider adding some drama to your body by introducing interesting prints as well as some shapes to your dresses or your skirts. Consider the mermaid shaped dress or a flounce skirt. The inverted triangle ladies, you don't have to do anything to hide your strong shoulders. But if you are interested, a halter neckline or one shoulder neckline can balance out your shoulders. Be careful with the spaghetti straps because the contrast with your shoulders can actually make your shoulders broader. If you're interested in knowing more about how to dress for your body shape, watch some of my other videos and also let me know what else you want to hear about on how to dress for your body shape. Subscribe to my channel, leave me a comment below. Thanks for watching, I will see you next week. Yeah, yeah.